In this problem, we have the sequence 7, 4, 1, negative 2 that continues on and we need to find the 43rd term. So, like in the past problem, I'll show you the intuitive way that I like to do it and then I'll show you the formula way of doing it, although they're both pretty similar. So I'll do the intuitive way first. So, if we're going from 7, 4, 1 to negative 2, what's the change each time? Well, realize that to go from 7 to 4, you're subtracting 3. 4 to 1, that's minus 3. And 1 to negative 2, that's minus 3. So therefore, I can say that minus 3 is our common difference, d. And now here's the next thing that you want to realize. So 7 is our first term, right? So I'm going to say this is our first term. And we want to go to the 43rd term. So if we're going by minus 3 each time, and we're going from the first to the 43rd term, how many times are we doing minus 3? Well, all you need to do is 43 minus 1 equals 42. So in other words, we're doing this minus 3 42 times. And then to find what that total change would be, just do 42 times that we're doing that minus 3. So in other words, 42 times negative 3 tells us how much we change in total. So if you do 42 times negative 3, that is negative 126. So let me erase all this now. And all this is telling us is that to go from 7, our first term, to the 43rd term, we have to subtract 126 in total. So we start at 7, we subtract 126, and we get the 43rd term. So just do 7 minus 126. The answer is negative 119. And that is our answer to this problem. This is the 43rd term. And then now let me show you the formula way of doing it. So I'm just going to erase all this here. So to do the formula way, let me just write down the formula. The formula says a of n, which actually replaces with 43, since that's what we want, is equal to a of 1, which is a 7, so we'll replace that, plus n minus 1 times d. And we know n is 43, because that's the term we want. And then d is just minus 3, as we found out. And as you'll see, it pretty much ends up being the same calculation as before. So this turns into 7 plus 43 minus 1 is 42 times negative 3. Order of operations states that we do the multiplication first. 42 times minus 3 is just negative 126. And then 7 plus negative 126 is equal to negative 119. So using both methods, we were able to get the same answer of negative 119. 